The cops are on the front lines of this war. Gordon needs this more than anyone. A wise decision, sir. We'll attack Falcone on two fronts tonight. Gordon through the police, and Batman by any means necessary. Whatever Falcone is planning, it ends tonight. He's a spider, Bruce. Eyes everywhere. A dense web of goons poised to trap you. No one has ever managed to bring him down. I haven't tried yet. This is a silver bullet. And it's gonna put Falcone down once and for all. I don't even want to know where you got this. No, you don't. Still, I gotta know one thing. Why give this to me? Don't get me wrong. I appreciate the hell out of this. Everyone on the force will too. We've been looking for this kind of firepower for years. Well, I'll just assume you were drawn to my effervescent personality. You know, as much as I appreciate you calling me here, I gotta make one thing crystal. I can't be bought. So you should know this isn't gonna change a thing about the investigation of your family. The Waynes always supported the Gotham Police. The investigation isn't the problem. It's the Wayne family name. Help me clear it. If your family's clean, I'll sing it from the rooftops. If they aren't, I'll still sing. You gotta understand, I'm bound to this badge. I gotta go. Came straight from a crime scene, haven't been home yet. Sometimes I think this whole city's a crime scene. We're just walking through it. What you're holding will make walking it much safer. Thanks, Bruce. Well, Lieutenant? Hey, stick to Jim. It's done. Good, so is our hunt. The drones located Falcone downtown, a place called the Skyline Club. Although you're not dressed for that kind of party. Well, I can always change in the car. Cameras and scanning tech are fully functional. All right. Let's find Falcone. Good point of entry. Another. What's the difference between the Mafia and City Council? I don't know. Aren't they the same thing? Only one of them is organized. Ooh. <laughs> You're cute. So, uh, are you alone? Not anymore, I'm not.
make your round? Yeah, no broken bones. Still healing from the last time, I bet. All it took was a couple of C notes this time. Nice and easy. Nice and easy, my ass. I know you burned powder tonight. The whole city can smell it. The White Rose. Falcone's symbol. A red rose after tonight. Nothing here. That's the most heavily guarded door in the building. Gotta be Falcone's hideout. Well, it won't be as easy as ringing the doorbell. Four armed guards. Stealth not an option. I'll put together a plan of attack. Stand by. Hmm. Couple of options for taking this guy down. Got it covered out. Bruce, have you formulated your plan of attack? I'm going in. Very good, sir. Your turn to crash his party.
out of the deal, because I did not make that mess at the docks. Then who did? No, we're done. Gotham's watching now. Ah. Go ahead, give him a show. I'll be walking free by tomorrow morning. Whoa, whoa, wait, get out of you. Falcone, while you still can. It's... <clears throat> the Waynes. They're behind all this. What do you mean? You really... You really want to take that crime? Well, the Waynes are the biggest gangsters in Gotham. God! Take him out! Fire and smoke could reportedly be seen from street level. Tonight, the Skyline Club 
a high-rise mafia hangout in downtown Gotham, was the arena for a clash between the notorious Batman and alleged mob boss Carmine Falcone, who was brutally wounded in the attack. Oh! Though I'd say the crime boss getting his is well overdue, Falcone has slipped through the law's grasp for years, but after this dramatic arrest and evidence released by the GCPD's Lieutenant Gordon, Falcone's going away for a long, long time. And speaking of newly uncovered criminal dealings, this brings me to the story everyone is talking about, the Wayne family. For generations, the big W on the Wayne Enterprises Tower was a reassuring sight. You knew that there was something pure at the heart of Gotham, that this city, for all its faults, was built by good people. But with Thomas and Martha's shining reputation called into question, we no longer have such assurances. And even worse, it seems the apple hasn't fallen far from the tree. Gotham's greatest son, Bruce Wayne, seen here in the company of gangsters, may be just as crooked as his parents. Wayne even refused to go on record when asked to defend his family's legacy. In a world where the Waynes, our golden family, are corrupt, who are we left with? Who can Gothamites look up to? The monster Batman? Only time will tell. Meanwhile, we'll keep digging for the truth. But the prominent feeling throughout Gotham is that the Wayne's time in the sun is ending. This entire cave. Master Bruce? Everything I built! I created all of this because I didn't want any more innocent people to die! If Falcone's telling the truth about my parents, then what the hell did we do this for? Bruce, I... What have you been hiding from me? Alfred! When your parents died, they left me as caretaker of their estate, their son, and their secrets. I would never betray them. Your parents were good people, Bruce, no matter what that thug Falcone told you. Then swear to me, there's no truth to it. The evidence you brought me on Falcone held up. Maybe I misjudged you. Now Batman's beating up mobsters, too. Wonder who he's after next. Hell of a view! Bruce, the Wayne name is toxic. I have to do what's best for my campaign. What's best for Gotham. I have to... distance myself. I will find the truth. Along with anyone who stands in my way. 